First, open your eBay Seller Hub. Click on Customize Table. You'll see a table appear. In this table, make sure to turn on the following options. Item Specifics, Custom Label SKU, Item Number, Available Quantity, Sold Quantity, Current Price, Start Date. Make sure all of these are selected. Or you can simply match the settings shown on my screen. Once done, click Save. Now open Ecom Sniper and click on Open Tracker. On the Tracker System page, first enable Stock Monitor, then choose Prime Only if you only want to track Prime items. Set the restock quantity to any number you'd like. If you select all items, it will monitor everything regardless of Prime status. Next, enable Price Monitor. Choose Markup Pricing. Enter the markup percentage you want. Price Trigger Threshold. This setting helps avoid small, unnecessary price changes. Example, your item on Amazon is $50. With a 100% markup and a .99 ending, your eBay price becomes $100.99. If Amazon's price changes slightly and the new eBay price stays between $98 and $102, Ecom Sniper won't make any changes because it's still within the $2 threshold range. But if Amazon's price drops or increases enough that your eBay price goes below $98, or above $102, then Ecom Sniper will update the price. It only updates when the eBay price difference is more than $2, or whatever value you set as your threshold. Only price monitor items with ending price. This setting is useful when you're sniping items. When you list a product, you can choose an ending price like 0 0.99, 0 0.97, or 0.95. For example, if you set your ending price to 0.99, the system will only monitor and reprice items that end with 0.99. If your sniped item ends with 0.60, but you haven't added 0.60 here, that item won't be monitored or repriced. Always make sure to include the correct ending price you use for your sniped items. Now let's move to additional settings. To make the tracker run continuously, enable continuous tracking. Set the timer in seconds for how long it should wait between each loop. For example, if you enter 100 seconds, it'll wait 100 seconds before starting again. If you want to use your browser while the tracker is running, enable pin tabs. If your computer is a bit slow, enable keep eBay page open for better performance. Once everything is set, click start tracking and Ecom Sniper will take care of the rest automatically.